Well, another big story that we're following this morning, the city of San Francisco is in the middle of a hiring crisis. Yeah, there's a report by the San Francisco Civil Grand Jury that finds thousands of vacant jobs are making the city less safe. Yeah, we have Crown Force Will Trant following the story for us live from the city. Will, what's going on? City Hall, they only have themselves to blame, and here's the reason why. They have the need, but they're not fast on filling that need. So take a look at your screen. The public, they are the ones suffering in San Francisco. And I'll break it down for you in many parts. Because they can't fill those vacancies, well, since the pandemic, response times by the police department could be as much as 90% or close to 90% longer than it was before the pandemic. Speaking of response times, if you call 911, 20% fewer calls are answered within the first 15 seconds or so. And of course, if you call 911, you desperately want them to pick it up immediately. If you hop on Muni, it's going to take you a little bit longer to wait for your bus to come because they don't have the drivers. Here's the reason why. Well, it takes, according to this report, sometimes it takes as long as eight and a half months to fill a vacancy that some of the applicants, they've reported that they have to go through at least 50 steps before a job is offered to that applicant. The report says they need to do a lot better. Try to shorten that down to 60 days from when you post the job until when you hire, also be more competitive with the private sector that San Francisco now is losing. A lot of the applicants, they would rather work in the private se sector because one, they can probably work remotely and the pay is better. Mayor Lyndon Breed, she is aware of this report and she has until August 20th to respond to it. Back to you.